Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Autos Ferris Prospecting. And uh, as you can see, we are at home. And we're going to do something a little different today. Um, super rainy day. It's supposed to get over an inch of rain today or up to an inch of rain today, depending on where you live. And so uh, we're going to do something a little different today, like I said. And uh, I'm going to spin you around and I'm going to take you into the garage. Today, we are at home. See, it's raining. I'm going to take you in through the man cave. Don't mind the mess. Go, Mariners. Today, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to run this fine little machine. Um, I got this uh, little micro dream mat. Uh, thanks to Sonny Rico. He was down at the Portland Gold Show and he brought picked that up and brought it home to me. Thanks, Sonny And what I got down here is I've got this I got that box of black sands from Kirk At Secret Creek prospecting and Went out and did a little prospecting with Sonny and his wife and he says hey you want some black sands from Cape D and I said yes and so Thank you to that guy over at Evergreen Prospectors for giving me something to do on a rainy day. So what we are going to do is we are going to drink some of that and we're going to eat them fine biscuits that uh, Mrs. Ferris made. And we are going to crank this up and I'll bring you back and uh, show you what we're doing today. Something a little different, but let's see how long it takes us to run this black sand and let's see what we get out of it. Well, hey everybody, we're back, <clears throat> and uh, as you can see in the background right there, Old Glory flies on my house every day, and so since we're at uh, Camp America, Washington Base Camp, I'm going to spin you around, and let's go in here and run some of this black sand and see what we can find. I don't know if you can see that, but... It's raining again. So let's go in here and uh, walk through the mess. And let's fire this old girl up. Got a little jet jar in there, a little clean water. Let's give her a little rub down here. And here we go. Let's hit first scoop of this black stuff. I know I could run a lot, but let's just see how this thing works. Mm, like a dream map. Anyway, I'm gonna set you up on the gonna set you up on the stand here. Let's run this little box. That's the one we're gonna start with, the one I got from Kirk. Let's see how long it takes us to go through this and let's see what we get out of her. Bring you back in a bit. Well, hey, we're back. We've uh, ran five, six scoops through this uh, just to see how good she's going to work and see if she's going to clean out. And I uh, let her clean out for a couple of minutes. Yes, there are a couple of little bits of gold up in here, but let's run this for a minute and. Uh, Get some scoops through here and we'll let her clean out and then we'll bring you back and uh, get you a little close-up of this and see if we can see any of that gold. Oh yeah, running beautiful.
hey, nobody wants to watch me run black sand through a cube all day, so I'll bring you back. We'll let this clean out and uh, we'll see, get you a close up here and see if we can see any of that uh, fine Washington Beach gold back in a bit. Well, hey, everybody, we're back. Um, good thing about being at uh, Camp America Washington Base Camp is uh, I didn't have to drive anywhere today. Didn't have to drive home, didn't have to get wet. Next to the coffee pot, big screen, mariners are on, good day. Anyway, so I was feeding this, uh, the gold cube, and I've got this micro mini dream mat in there, and uh, felt that I was feeding it a little too hard. Didn't know if them little uh, vortexes were plugging up on me or, or what, but so I decided to run it just a little slower. And I'm uh, going to give it a scoop, give it a couple minutes, give it a scoop. But I'm going to turn you around. I'm going to show you. Uh, do got a couple of little bits in here. And uh, show you what we got. So, let me find it. I'm going to put my finger right by the little vortex. You can see right there. I picked up a little bit. And if you look right in that little vortex right there you can see another little teeny bit but so I'm gonna run it a little slower I'm just gonna give it a scoop every couple minutes and uh, let it clean out and we'll just keep feeding it and see what we get but so far so good I like this little machine I like that little map we'll bring it back well hey Video update. So we're about three quarters of the way through that pan of black sand. And, um, like I said, just running it slow. And been checking it out. And there's a few little bits in here dancing around. Spin you around and show you. So as you can see, we have whittled it down. Been another, I don't know, 20, 25 minutes. And bear it. Let me get down here and let me find them first. Right up there in that little, right there in that little vortex. There's three, three little bits in there. And I've seen a couple of little bits over here. And where is it at? I know right in there, right at the end of that finger in that little cell, there's a little bit or two down in there. So, yeah. We're gonna run this box. Excuse me. We're gonna run this box and let her flush out, and we'll do a little, little clean out on them. See what we get out of her. Well, hey, it's been about a half an hour, and uh, this is the last bits that's in the pan. What I'm gonna do is get a little water on that. Try to get this uh, all washed down in there. This little dream mat works really good. So, pan is empty. Everything is in here. Uh, I think we'll give her about 15 minutes and clean her out. And let her clean out and uh, see what we can see in there. Back in there. Well, hey, we're back and uh, let this thing clean out a little bit. Um, my garage is kind of poorly lit and it's lit up pretty good, but you know, it's just kind of a dim flat light in here. So uh, what I did is I broke out a flashlight and went looking around and found a couple pieces of gold. Let me turn you around. So let me find it right you look right there at the end of the flashlight, I'll just zoom down in there and maybe catch it. A nice little speck sitting down there, right? No, oh, it's hard to pick up. Nice little speck sitting down there in the bottom of the vortex. And I've shined around and if you look up into all of themselves, it's kind of hard to see, but there's a, I don't know, 60, 70 specks probably up in here. 
There's a good one. Good little cell right. There's a little piece right there. And if you look down in there, there's that little vortex. It's got three little bits in it. So there's a few specks down in here. But I decided I'm gonna I was gonna clean it out, but I'm not. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop over here and we're just gonna run part of one of Sonny's buckets through here because I'm gonna eventually have to clean out that water right there sand build up in it so gonna have one of those and keep running sand back in a bit well hey everybody we're back you see we ran about a half of that bucket probably been another 45 minutes hour but I'm gonna show you I'm starting to suck up sand out of my little uh, catch down here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shut this down. I'm going to shut this down and we are going to uh, change out the water and see, uh, clean it up and see, run some more. We're going to clean this gold cube out and just see if there's anything in it. Bring it back in a bit. Well, hey everybody, we are back. So. We cleaned out the cube. I'm gonna spin you around, show you um, what I did here. So we got the cube all cleaned out, completely washed out into that tub. Them are the cons. And while I had it shut down, I got the water completely cleaned out, fresh batch. And uh, what I want to show you is see if I can do this. And yes. Note to self, do this shit out on the back deck. I made a freaking mess. But, let's see if I can shine this light down here and see if you guys can see that. Uh, got a nice little bit there. Got some bits right there. Got a couple of bits right there. And we got a couple of bits over there. So, what I'm going to do is, we're going to shake this down and, uh, Put it in that pan right there. Let's see what's in it. Back in a bit. So hey, we are black. What we did today is uh, ran about, uh, I don't know, two and a quarter gallons of black sand and, and uh, through the gold cube. Ran it on the micro mini mat, you know, dream mat. But I'm gonna turn you around and show you what I got. But, you know, I just ran a Mike Vendetta pay bag, pay dirt bag, uh, 10 grammer. I don't know if I didn't get it, uh, my gold cube completely cleaned out or what, but I'm going to show you what I got, but I don't know if it's all from, uh, um, from this beach sand. So I got, still, I got two, two and a half gallons in there and I'm going to run that today and I'm going to compare and see what I got, but check this out. So, focus, got a few little bits in there and, you know, either that's the best goddamn beach sand ever or I didn't get my gold cube completely cleaned out after running, uh, after running that 10 gram bag of, uh, Mike Vendetta pay dirt. So, got everything cleaned up in there, fresh water, we're going to go back in here and we're gonna slam out some more uh, black sand from the beach. And honestly, I wished I had smell-o-vision because <laughs> this stuff has got an aroma to it. So anyway, bring you back after we uh, see what we can see after we run this next half bucket back in a bit. Hey, we're back. So we ran a, another half bucket and uh, Got a little, couple little specks in here that you can see, so I'm gonna turn around and show you. Half bucket down. And I'm gonna get my glasses down. If you look right there, you can see a little speckle, speckle. There's one. There's a couple of little ones. You can see one down on the bottom of the drop vortex right there. Got a couple little specks in there. There's one. So yeah, 
Can this run run this other bucket and let's see what's in it. So we'll bring you back after another half bucket and let her clean up. See if we see any more specks in there. Back in a bit. Little video update here. Um, we've ran uh, got a half a bucket left, and what I did was started sucking sand again. So what it is I did was a uh, complete clean out. I'll turn around and show you. So we're down to last half bucket. Did a complete clean out. And I made a hell of a mess, but we're going to take you out to the table outside and show you what we got. I was a little skeptical after the first uh, run, but check it out. So bring you down in here. Got some little bits right there. Got a few little bits right there, a few bits right there. And we got some bits in the sand, and I had a couple of decent bits in there. And so there was the first pan I did, which I thought was kind of crazy and maybe contaminated. Um, with some Vendetta Pay dirt that I had ran. But, you know, hey, second pan showed pretty good. So I'm going to go in here. We're going to go in and run that last bucket, half a bucket, and clean it out again. And see what we get out of it again back in a bit well hey we are back and we are done probably about four hours um two and a two and a quarter of these little buckets felt like forever two three complete clean outs and uh well i'm getting ready to do the third one but anyway i'm gonna turn you around and check it out so, and as you can see, bucket is empty and bucket is clean. And uh, let's see if I can do this. Go real slow, and if you look right there, there's a little piece, and right there in that little vortex catch is a piece. There's a piece probably right there in that vortex couple of pieces in there there's a couple of pieces right there looks like one two three four maybe five little bits in there there's a little bit right there a little bit right there in the center of the screen you can see there's a little bit right there focus a little bit right Mm, right there at the end of my finger, right there at the end of my finger. So yeah. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to make a beer run. And uh, I'm going to come back. I'm going to shut this down. I'm going to let it keep cleaning itself out. And I'm going to come back and clean this thing up. And I'm going to show you three, uh, three clean outs side by side. Back in a bit. Well, hey. We are back and we are done. I am going to flip you around and show you that uh, we are cleaned up and I'm going to show you the uh, my three clean outs. So as you can see, we are broke down, well cleaned out. And uh, I'm just going to let that mess dry up and we are going to clean it up with a vacuum. Oh yeah, shout outs. So out the door we go, put up the umbrella so I didn't get wet. So here is cleanup number three. I'm just going to put my finger in there just so you can see just how tiny them little bits are. And I'm going to say there's probably overall counting these ones that are just floating around in the water down here. I'm going to say there's probably... 50 little bits in there. Okay. And here was the very first cleanup. I'm going to put my finger in here so you can see how little them bits are. Fair bits, you know, but you get down in here, there are some super finds in here. 
Alright. And here is the second little cleanup. And I'm gonna get down in here close. Focus. And as you can see, a lot of super fines down in there. But that's probably 250, 300 little specks. That one right there, cleanup number one. Probably 100 little specks. So, you know, I think uh, between whatever I got from Kirk and, and uh, Sonny, for the first run gave me the first pan and uh, the second pan is uh, all the stuff that I got from uh, Evergreen Prospectors and the third pan is everything I got from Evergreen Prospectors so do I think it'll weigh up now but it was a lot of fun on a rainy day and uh, thanks to Sonny over at Evergreen Prospectors if you don't know him go check out his channel puts out some good stuff and a shout out to my guy Kirk over at Secret Creek. If you don't know him, go over and check him out. He puts out some good stuff. And uh, yeah, we didn't make it to the river today, but um, I'm really not a pay dirt guy, but doing this beach sands is kind of like going to the river. And had a lot of fun. Burned up about four and a half hours, <laughs> five hours. And uh, had a good time at home, close to the fridge. Uh, got to watch some sports today in and out of feeding the uh, gold cubes so I think that's about it for today and uh, see you on the next one hope you guys like it and until then peace America <laughs>